where over 300,000 people live, the capital city of Wales, Cardiff. It's one of the UK's fastest growing cities, and while this growth is a signal of strength and a period of opportunity for the city's economy, it brings challenges too. My city produces this, this, and this. And this is what happens to the waste. The waste from our black bins, or red striped bags, is taken to Viridor in Cardiff Bay. It's dropped into a furnace, burned at over 850 degrees, and produces enough energy to power over 30,000 homes in the city. Our green bag or recycling waste makes its way to the Council's Materials Reclamation Facility in Cardiff East. It's sorted manually and mechanically to divide it into separate recyclable products. Once the items have been separated, they are delivered to reprocessing facilities, which convert the recycled goods back into raw materials. These raw materials are then sold to manufacturers who convert them into products for us to buy. Council Collected Food Waste is processed at Welsh Water's Organic Energy Food Waste Site in Rover Way. It's done through a process called anaerobic digestion, which produces biogas. This gas is then used as a fuel to produce heat and electricity. And it equates to the same amount of energy used to power 2,000 homes. Garden waste is sent to Welsh Water's Organic Energy Garden Waste Site at Lambie Way. It's processed through composting by piling organic matter in long rows. The waste is shredded, mixed and put into windrows which are turned frequently to regulate heat and moisture and improve oxygen content. On average this takes 8 to 10 weeks and the resulting compost can then be used for landscaping and building projects. 